And it is now official that Nairobi County will have a governor at last for the next 10 months to the 2022 general election. A three-judge Court of Appeal bench sitting in Nairobi dismissed a petition by former Nairobi Governor Mike Sonko challenging Nairobi Deputy Governor Ann Kananu's assumption of office as the capital's governor. Ann Kananu, who has been running the affairs of the county on interim basis since January 2020, is set to be sworn in on Monday. I, Ann Kananu Mwenda, after numerous and lengthy court battles and political intrigues, Nairobi County will finally have a governor almost one year since the host of former Governor Mike Mbuvisonko. So help me God. The Court of Appeal on Friday declined to issue any orders stopping the swearing-in of Anne Kananu Mwenda as the governor of Nairobi County, putting an end to an appeal lodged by Mike Sonko. The ruling by a three-judge bench paving the way for the swearing-in of Kananu has been serving on interim basis since January this year. In the ruling, appeal court judges Wanjiru Karanja, Jamila Mohammed, and Jesse Lesid dismissed the application on grounds that the issue of swearing-in Kananu was not raised in the High Court and the judgment delivered by the same court did not address or determine the issue. Further, the judges ruled that Sonko's application did not meet the threshold set for applications under Rule 52B of the Court of Appeal rules. The Court of Appeal concluding that the application dated 29 June 2021 is without merit and the same is hereby dismissed with costs to the respondents. <laughs> Kananu is now said to be sworn in as the next governor, with sources intimating to Citizen TV that the swearing-in ceremony has been set for Monday in the capital. The assumption to the office in governor's rule dictates that the date and place of swearing-in is gazetted. Once sworn in, Kananu will have powers to appoint a new cabinet. Currently, the Nairobi County government is run by members of the County Executive Committee appointed by Sonko. Kananu is also set to join the Council of Governors to replace former Governor Mike Sonko, who was hosted in December last year. Discharge my duties and perform my functions in... After her swearing in, attention will shift to her choice of deputy governor for the remainder of the term she will be in office. After party. Mike Sonko now prepares to head to the Supreme Court to challenge the ruling by the Court of Appeal. After party, after party.